Swingful week for net gets another double top is formed, hitting the highs at 2.38. We have seen the price is dropping sharp, and it in fact it is closed the week at around 2.18, which is a very very good support. What to expect in the coming week? Is it going to deliver a sharper bearish candle and taking the prices to a two dollar levels, or there is a possibility of a reversal? In general, double top means a correction here, but we will see our expectation with the help of charts and indicators. Towards the end of the update, I'll be sharing the trading levels and strategy for the coming week. Watch till the end. This is a weekly review. I do share my twice a day updates. First with the Asia session and next with the US session for natural gas. The subscribe and press the bell icon to get the notifications. Do like, share, and comment. Join the free Telegram channel for live updates and join the channel memberships here on YouTube to support them. Let's start first on the weekly charts. You will find. See, it has shown a good support here at two dollar levels. With that, we have seen it rising. Uh, in fact, the last to last week also, we have seen similar pattern hitting the highs. We have seen a good drop. Again, this week hitting the highs, we have seen a good drop, and it has closed at the lows. Now, this is important. It is increasing body size. It has formed a double top. It appears that the coming week it is going to form a waterfall, which can take the prices to towards two dollar levels. This is a point which you should keep a note of. At the same time, see bullishness is only and only if it breaks beyond 2.38, 2.4 zone. This a uh, this is the point you should keep a note of. 2.38 has now become a wall for it to break. And yes, it is not that it cannot reverse. It can reverse and break this with a similar size of candle. But right now, it is more of looking downwards. And specifically after hitting the highs, looking at the drop, it appears that it can begin the week on a bearish. If you look at the formation here, the drop retracement, the drop retracement, and see this is definitely in the near term trading in this bearish channel, delivering lower highs, lower lows. However, when you see the formation like this, you will find that uh, it is under retracement, and till the time it stays about two and one point nine, we should not be expecting it to move towards the lows at one point five, one point six again. So this is a point we should keep a note. And yes, moving averages are trading with divergence. Price is just trying striking towards twenty period, getting a resistance there. Stock elastic rising from the oversold levels. Magni almost have flattened here, but uh, yes, it is trading under the uh, after in the red side of it. It is trading on the bearish note. But I will say the divergence is minimal. It suggests that the bears are also not very much interested. RSI is almost flat here. Coming to day. Now look at the daily charts. What has happened on the daily? See earlier it has formed a very good support at 2.2. Now what has happened after the support? We have seen a stronger rise and see these three candles. And now what I was showing on the weekly charts, you can see this one greener candle and see this is the same formation which we are seeing on the weekly charts and it appears that it is going to deliver a similar size of candle here. Now look at the formation on the weekly charts. It appears almost the same. And it appears that there could be a red candle, third red candle coming in the coming week. And now also on the daily charts, remember one fact: divide this into two, almost symmetry. Double top is seen. Price is reversing with the double tops. That yes, there could be little downside. But how far is it going to break below two? A uh, possibility exists. Yes, it is trading below the twenty period moving average, and the moving averages are also trading bearish here. Look at the stock ISIC. This is looking downwards, trading bearish. The MACD, if you see after crossing over here, it is traded bullish. It is willing to converge crossover for a sell, and this could be a minor retracement before it looks forward to an upside. RSI dropping here, trying to trade bearish. Coming to four hour on the four hour chart, see yes, there is a crossover again, a bearish sign, two point two, two point two five, very very good resistance exists here. Also, if you look at the formation here, you can just draw a parallel here. You will find it has to break beyond 2.3, 2.35, 2.38 zone in order to confirm a reversal. What is happening here? After a big bearish candle, the drop retracement, drop retracement. It is trading in this normal or in in this uh, you can say moderately bearish channel here. Thus, in the coming week, you can buy 2.2, but then it has to break beyond 2.25 first resistance zone in order to keep moving upwards. On the four hour charts, also this is a bearish cross, which is certainly a sign, which is not supportive of the bulls. If you look at the stock elastic on the four hour charts, is rising. The MACD here is bearish, and it is trading with divergence. It is almost appearing to be at bottom, 
the RSI is also appears to be at bottom. Coming to the monthly charts, we have already seen that the moving averages on the monthly charts have crossed over on the sell side and are trading with divergence and are staying bearish. Next on the monthly charts also, similarly what we have seen on the weekly charts, the drop, the retracement, lower lows, lower highs, it is trading in this bearish channel for the near term. Now also on the monthly charts, remember this fact, what has happened couple of months back, it has hit the highs, it has shown a pullback and then a bearish candle. Has now the current candle is a swing candle here. You can see this lower lows are seen, lower highs are seen. Very important to note that it has tried approaching towards 20 period but uh, in fact towards the median of the Bollinger Bands it has failed to do so and it is definitely uh, going to close with the swing. Second observation it can close at the doji and confirm the bearishness for the coming month if it closes in red somewhere below 2 you can say that the coming month also going to bring the bears where we can look forward to another round of drop taking it towards lower low. Right now I can say it is at the state of indecision here it is definitely showing swings also second thing here is see receive previously you have seen this it was delivering higher lows and higher highs here now see it is breached this channel but any closer below this channel is the confirmation that the bears are back in action and the coming month also is going to remain bearish so the coming week is important where is going to close is going to be very very important now on the downside, we know 2.11, 2.15 is one important support zone and then $2 levels. As long as natural gas in the coming week respects this zone, we can say that the chances of reversal will be very, very high. Yes, chances of reversal will be very, very high. So uh, let's discuss the levels which you should trade and profit but before that look at the indicator see monthly stochastic looking downwards which is a slight bearish sign the MACD interestingly the MACD has been there for months for years you can see last couple of years it has been trading sharply bearish hitting the highs it has erased all the gains and it is at a multi-year low on MACD yes it was last time in 2012 we have seen such lows and see now it is the time for it to converge but for it to converge and cross over it requires to have a greener candle this month and next month that will confirm that net gas in the is on the reversal path but right now it is not showing any such intent now also look at the this rsi this is also dropped a bit so now we have seen the charts we have seen the indicators time for me to give you the trading levels and strategy and uh, by the time I provide you the trading levels and strategy, if you want to learn this art of trading, join my mentorship band. If you just want to trade as per the signals, be a part of my signals channel on Telegram, where we trade diverse instruments, including multiple indices and multiple commodities from across the globe. So press the bell icon. And yes, you can connect with me over Telegram or email for your queries related to the signals channel or if you have any query related to the mentorship batch and yes those who had asked me to recommend a broker which offers a safe free account with lowest spreads and no hidden charges you can find the recommended broker link also in the channel and video description now first let's talk about the levels to buy certainly 2.2 is one level where you can initiate a buying entry where you can expect it to see nearest is at 2.2 and the strongest is at 2.25 so 2.22, 2.25, the two resistances it needs to break in order to keep moving towards 2.3. Once it stays beyond 2.3, we can say that the chances are higher. We will look forward to 2.34 and 2.38. And we already know that 2.38 after forming the double top has become a very, very strong resistance. So I will wait for it to break beyond this. Any breakout beyond this, certainly I will be looking forward to 2.45 and 2.5 levels very, very soon. But looking at the move for last couple of weeks, it appears it is not interested in such a stronger movement on the upside. But this is that guess. It shows you something and delivers something else. What we had seen for last couple of weeks, it is stayed bullish and then has erased all the gains very significantly towards the end of the week. So now on the where to sell, you can sell here at see 2.15. Very, very, very good support here 2.15. And below this, you can expect 2.11, 2.08. And if it breaks below 2.08, you can expect 2.04 and $2 levels. 
very important milestone for net gas here because below this significant bearishness may prevail 1.96 1.92 and then 1.8 levels should be there very very soon at least it does not appear to be the case for the coming week that it is going to drop towards 1.8 i do not expect it to but yes certainly staying below two dollar levels will increase the chances of bearish momentum here which i still am doubtful of i still will be looking forward to a uh, bullish reversal in the next few weeks for natural gas so where it closes in the coming week is definitely going to be watched any movement beyond 2.4 2.5 is certainly an indication that the bulls will be in action in the coming in few weeks take your trades accordingly like share subscribe and comment join my mentorship badge join my signals channel Reach out to me for your queries related to the services. Join the free Telegram channel for live updates and join the channel membership there on YouTube to support that. Thank you very much. Have a great profitable trading week ahead and a happy weekend.